here? Yeah, because it's pretty high up there. Yeah, yeah I want to. Maybe I should close the door. No, no, that's okay, because you can just see the. Okay, what's this? Try to get ready. So I had this one job where I was working as a personal assistant to big name director. Actually it was director's girlfriend. So it was a great job, but it was a step removed from an excellent job. But it was a lot of fun and I made a lot of friends that I still have to this day. Mads is one of them. Mads and I would sit in the office at like 5.30 at night and watch everybody looking out the window and looking at everybody leaving for the night knowing we still had a lot of work ahead of us and we had this song Dungeon Girls and we called ourselves that and we were like gonna make a whole comic strip of it but we didn't really have time because we were always working. There was this one time where I got a chance to go to New York and it was my first time going to New York and I was staying with director and his girlfriend in their amazing apartment and basically they had an apartment that was totally furnished and outfitted and then they had one right below it that was not furnished, but it was still beautiful. It was like looking out on Washington Square Park. It was amazing. And, uh, but it didn't have any furniture. The only furniture it had in it was a bed in the bedroom. And then everything else was just vacant and huge windows and it, it was beautiful, but it was vacant except for the bed. So I kept everything I had in the bedroom. And one morning I was get I left you know I came out of the bedroom and I went to the kitchen and all of a sudden a gust of wind came through one of the windows and shut the bedroom door and <laughs> and locked it my clothes I was wearing a t-shirt no bra and some underwear no shoes everything I own is in the bedroom the phone is in the bedroom the keys are in the bedroom so I had to find something in the kitchen to prop open the front door so that I could actually take the elevator down to the lobby among some famous people and you know wealthy people who are clothed <laughs> I'm like hi hi trying to pull this down and I get to the lobby they were able to come and unlock it but it was one of those moments where I thought previously I had been on the inside trying to get out and now I was clearly on the outside trying to get in but the key is within and learning to be present the other key is keep some clothes in the other room <laughs>